Dublin Marley here, back again. More War on the Sea, playing the Japanese side, and uh, pretty much slaughtering the Allies. Japanese is easy mode, other than some random invasions that they're trying to do, but it shouldn't be too difficult to stop all them. Gonna inquire building a bunch of merchant fleets. Uh, let's look at the carriers. This one's fresh, completely fresh. This one, it's good for now. All right, let's get this game on the road. So the sea lanes are open, which means I probably need to buy a big, big fuel transport for this guy and probably another merchant. And then the other group, oh, what do we have over there? Well, that's definitely uh, worthy of investigation. Probably something like that. And I hope I'm in range. Wow, that's a cruiser. You know what? You go this way. I probably need to build up two there we go. I probably need to build up one cruiser force and one destroyer force before I start the invasion. That way when I'm dropping a bunch of people on Sri Lanka I'm probably good all right let's see what we got that is a cruiser all right patrol boat patrol boat Well, we'll do six for him, three, Three, 
to two and we'll do one for this last guy over here I don't think I'm gonna hit him anyway those are uh, extremely hard to hit boats really just care about these three anyway And that cruiser definitely want to get rid of him. Those pesky patrol planes can find my carriers. Alright. Not going to hit the uh, small boats, I take it. Ooh. Nice, 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 nice. Little bit of weather problems, but other than that, looking pretty good. Nice. Cruiser is dead. That just leaves these two. He doesn't look good. He'll probably serve him. I can never tell with those boats. Maybe not. To be honest, I might get both of them. Mm. Yeah, the misses aren't caused by speed, they're caused by sea state. Mm. The rough seas, the smaller the boat, the more chance it has to go mm. underneath. It's hard mm. to tor torpedo a boat with a shallow draft and a small mm. size. Mm. Probably that boat. But this gas about ready to go down. Everyone but the uh, patrol boat. And that makes this very, very simple. Alright, you're going to skip that. Oh no, you still don't have a destroyer with you. Yeah, don't do that. Don't get caught by a patrol boat. That would be bad. So, look at that. That has to be... Something down south. And it's coming from there. Something like that. Yeah. 
If those are those French biplanes, I'm so confused. And they're coming from here. Go kill some French biplanes. All right, let's go look at this. No, these are... So that means there's a carrier somewhere no, these have drop tanks. There's no way. Where could these be coming from? I am not going to micromanage this fight. So if these guys are sitting out there And I doubt they can be across the sea. There has to be a carrier somewhere real close. And it has to be the good carrier. Yeah, the Zeros are unquestionably the best plan in the game for uh, fighters. They just tear people up, man. That's why whenever I play the Pacific game, launch like 15 Zeros. Or just launch the entire wing. Just keep an extra light carrier with your main carrier. I think that's good. Alright. I am officially annoyed by this. No, Claude. I did not mean to do that.
I don't know how I'm not in range. Of course. I would love to know where these guys are coming from. So those are Indian fighters. Very, very confused. All right, let's do some math here. That is 1,400 nautical miles. There is no way those fighters have that range. Even Sea Harriers didn't have that great of range. So something's like here. I don't know, man. All I know is when I find him, I'm going to kill him. It's amusing, I'm so annoyed. I'm making all these patrols just to try and catch this guy. I just don't know where that guy could be coming from. And look at that, look at the, look at the, somewhere here? And I've got plenty of planes flying out there. I am totally confused by this. Alright, we're winning all those battles.
from here to there? I don't, I don't get it, man. Yes, you are encountering Singapore. When I find that carrier, you are so dead. Be honest, I just don't know where. You'd think I'd have enough planes flying around. that develop a little bit. Trying to watch down here. And not miss stuff like this. Alright, let's tactical this up. sure what this is either way probably send two at every of the destroyers what am I at 15 all right And then I'll just send three at all these guys. That should be good. And just hope they don't get shot down. I really wish they'd, they would work in columns of twos. I think it's because they don't have more um, 
escorts. Because in the base game, they almost always are in either columns of twos, or they're actually in the straight defensive formations. How I love the two heavy cruisers, two light cruisers, and two destroyers mix. Heavy seas though, so I probably miss a bunch. Got the destroyer or whatever the hell that is back there. Looking like everyone got hit. I might get a clean sweep. A lot of misses though. Yeah, that guy's sinking. So I got three still, and two of them look really bad. Not sure about the guy in the back. Yeah, I think he only got one. Probably some weird destroyer escort. You got... Oh no, you dropped. No, go back inside. All right, one moderate, moderate, one scuttled. So five out of six, not too shabby. And the always valuable command point, RTB. Now let's go look for the real game. Where is this annoying ass I don't see where he could be. For a that's a thousand six hundred. Right. Let's uh supply, supply all the fuel, all the engineering, all the engineering, all supply. 
engineering and more fuel. Interesting. Well, there's something here. And I would like to see what it is. Yeah, I can't see anything. No star shells, that's good. I'm not going to sit there and look for something I don't know where they're at. All right, no star shells. No splashes, that's always important. Oh, no, there's star shell behind me. Alright, there's something that way. It is... 180? Let's figure it out. Probably not the best idea to do this by uh, myself, but... It's probably the carrier. Or just a lowly patrol boat? Man, you crazy boy. But you're not going to fire at the guy with the big, big bright lights next to you? You're a pretty stupid patrol boat, man. I got a lot of guns.
Wow, these are all direct hits, man. I feel bad for this guy. Alright, let's get out of there. Now back to my regular scheduled game of find the insane people. See, I'm pretty sure the Sea Harriers don't have the yellow tips on those planes. Those had to be from here. There's no way. You guys have wasted a lot of ammo. So, turn them in. And I'll be able to buy a whole new force here shortly. Two ships. Trying to keep my torpedoes alive. And he is not there. I think he went south. There he is. to uh, patrol boat patrol. To be honest, this is actually perfect for these guys. It wasn't that good. Ah, there we go. Not a, not a lot of 
flooding. But the fire should uh, take care of this guy. Having one repair is just not preferable. So I turned in the cruiser force. I think I'm going to buy 10 destroyers and get a 10 destroyer uh, troop transport. And then whatever's left over, I'll buy more cruisers and add that to the cruiser force. That is 10 ships right there. How soon can you launch again? 1.4 hours. They always love to do it at the same time. There we go. Tactical that up.
right. These all look like destroyers. That looks like a cruiser of some sort. Wow, it doesn't actually look that great. Get five to that one. And then the miracle one here. Probably going to lose a whole bunch of ships or planes here. But well, well, well worth it. hear that I don't have time for that man I think the cruiser just got a whole bunch of duds Five hits over there. Six, seven hits. Seven hits. Three down. For five planes, I'll take that. Definitely want to watch this burn for a while, though. He doesn't look too bad. All those duds kind of screwed me. Still have four smoking. Mm. All right, he stopped. Mm. 
He don't look too good. You definitely don't look too good. Still doesn't explain the mystery carrier. Yes, ram each other. Man, I just don't know. No, nope. not getting you. Wow, just three sunk and three damaged. That's not bad. Would have liked to have gotten the cruiser. Oh, there you are. What about launching some more mm. nothing doing there Tactical it up. I might actually run the British out of ships, man. I know they don't have a lot of ships. Probably 100% misses here. Yep, too rough. Well, at least for that guy. Man, the carrier air war is going to be nuts. RTB.
I don't know where he went, man. Wow, that was beautiful. got that guy you guys get this guy and you guys get this guy pretty sure those are the most wounded they all looked it God, this mini Vals is so much better than just regular, uh, the base game. When you have, like, three. One of you guys was that critical, man. This has got to be able to send you guys over the edge. three burning. I don't know what this is. British. It's gotta be a light cruiser. Ten five inches probably. Or six inches maybe. Probably five inches. Like the burning, that's for sure. Man, I don't think I'm going to get anybody except this guy. It 
It's so hard to judge the damage fouls do. Especially since you can get a magazine with these guys pretty easily. What are you? Critical, critical. Yep. For shame, guys. For shame. Now, do I have... I don't think I have any capability. Yeah, two and a half. Well. He's probably getting away. care about that. I'm not even worried if he runs into that guy. They should should easily make work of that guy. I'm going to save those points. I don't know where he's at, so it's kind of pointless to launch. guys join up and merge up nice little cruiser force being built and they're out of ammo See if I can manage some cargo here. Well, first off, let's see if what I can buy. MS fourteen.
and then AKM. That's better. And let's manage this cargo. And now I have a real troop transport convoy. And now I can start building up here for the push to there. I mean, these are going to fall here shortly. But that guy can now transport like 3,000-ish. And I'll add another one of those uh, 650 guys to him. Depending on the points, I might even add more. Well, I think I'm going to end it here. Thanks for joining me. Doing uh, not a lot of great stuff, but uh, doing some good stuff. Wrecking some convoys and just getting the logistics of grabbing that. This is going to be a level 5 airfield real quickly. I'm not busted, busted it up yet. Because I don't want to have them blow it up. But we've got plenty of resources to send over there. And he'll probably get another fueler. I'm probably going to have to turn in a carrier. Probably, probably just turn in one. And just start that rotation up again too. And then, then I need to buy a 10 destroyer group. And then everything that's left over goes to these guys. Which I'll probably just fill with destroyers as well. I don't think I need to have the uh, cruisers. I'm only really running into destroyer on down right now. Either way. I'm out of here. Later, all.